hey, 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 we're friends, so I feel like we can talk about this, okay? So there's a couple things that have happened with me getting older. One, I don't poop like I used to, right? Um, one, I'm on medication that I think is causing constipation. This isn't fun. My husband told me to take three Dolgalax. That was not gentle. That was not a good, no, please do not ever do that. He failed to mention that he was prepping for a colonoscopy when he did that. It's not a pleasant experience. But this organic smooth move, I got it from Amazon, is really pretty gentle. Again, we're friends so we can talk about these kinds of things, right? Um, it just kind of keeps you a little bit more regular. Um, the taste isn't terrible. I just drink it in the morning and it's great. Number two thing that I know about getting older is uh, my skin has been oily my whole life, right? Um, I didn't even use a moisturizer because I thought that that would make me more oily. That's wrong. If you're oily, your skin thinks it's dry and produces more oil. So you need to moisturize, right? Here's another thing. As our skin gets drier, um, it gets tighter, which creates more wrinkles. I don't have time for that. I don't know if you have time for that, but I do not have time for that. Okay, so here's a couple things we can do. You especially get those wrinkles around your eyes. Use one of two of these eye creams, okay? This one is an age reversing, so it's gonna help with wrinkles, um, fine lines, all those kinds of things. And then this is the brightening line, and it's gonna help with those dark circles, dark lids. I kinda go back and forth. I just opened this one. Um, it's in a fancy new thing. It used to be in a little tube. But here's the deal with eye cream. That's probably too much, but um, you're going to want to put it on your ring finger because you don't want to pull that really delicate skin under your eye. So sometimes that under eye, for whatever reason, can just be more dry. Make sure that you're hydrating under the eyes and your entire face, okay? So here's the thing. Um, I have numerous different kinds of moisturizers. Um, depending on your skin type, because here's the thing is what I use, this smells so good. It smells like sweet tarts. What I use may not be what you need, right? Okay. So here's the thing. I love the age reverses because again, I'm going to be 42 this year. My skin is starting to look a little older, right? I'm not 20 anymore, but, um, this is amazing. It smells like sweet tarts. So I love it. Okay. Um, a lot of times I'll use this at night. Um, so that it really just has that time to soak in without all the environmental factors, my makeup, all those things, okay? So I really like this Lumi Radiance Moisturizer because it has the SPF 22, so your skin is being protected. You can see where I didn't always protect my skin. Um, there's these dark spots, all this stuff going on. Um, this will help brighten your skin. So even like the melasma, the sunspots, the age spots, this is gonna help with that. I'm not gonna tell you it's a miracle worker, it's gonna make it all go away, but I've seen some pretty amazing results with it and I really, really love the fact that it has SPF 22, okay? Here's another one of my favorites. You can see I've used it a lot. This is the Pure Rose. It will help with um, moisture, rosacea, redness, all the things. You can see that I'm not nearly as red. For the longest time, I rotated between these two. This is the Tea Tree. It's going to help with oily skin, acne prone skin, all those things, right? Um, but I didn't want to use it every day because I didn't want to dry out my skin. I wanted my skin to have plenty of moisture, right? So I would rotate these two in the morning and this one at night. And I know that that seems like a lot, but you guys, these just aren't that expensive. Like I used to pay $40 for a moisturizer. I think these are like 14, 12. I mean, they're under 20 for sure, um, but they're, they're very inexpensive, okay? So this can be for all skin types though, oily, dry, any of the things. Um, but I love it if you have red skin. It just kind of, calm, rose water will kind of calm down inflammation and I love that about it. So either one of those. And then if you're dry, like real dry, we have the aloe line, which I forgot it. Oh, it's right down there. It's fine. Um, the aloe line and then the calendula line, both of these will be great for um, dry skin. This is gonna be really, really good for sensitive skin. So I can help you pick if you just shoot me a message um, I can tell me about your skin, tell me what kind of desired results you want, um, and I can kind of help you pick what moisturizer you need, but it's so key. If you don't do skincare, at least wash your face and moisturize, right? I mean, I like to tone and to do the eye cream and do the brightening serums and those kinds of things, but bare minimum, please wash your face and please moisturize your skin. You will thank me when you are older because your skin will look healthy, it will look vibrant, it will love you, and it's not going to be as angry, right? Angry skin produces more oil, gets dry and flaky, um, gets acne, just all the things that 
we don't want. Okay. So message me if you have a question about which one you need. Um, and again, don't forget about the tea on Amazon because as we get older, things just change. Things just change. <laughs>